Just one, please. Oh, yeah? Think you can read? All outside food goes into the trash. Now, enjoy the film. Here you go. No food? Let me see that rabbit of yours. Come on, fork it up. No! Looks innocent enough. I knew it! This guy's stuffed with candy! See? Nothing gets past me, missy. Here you go. Shame on you, sneak snake. I'll take that. You sly like your friend there? Not on my watch. Oh, I don't hear anything. Little does she know, this thing totally has a hidden zipper! But first, you gotta get all the fluff out. Then, to mimic the fluffiness, snag some marshmallows like these. The big fluffy ones are the best! Then put them into your cuddly pal. Once that's done, zip that thing back up. Looks normal, right? I don't feel any candy in here. Smells a little sweet, though. Uh, you're all clear. Phew! Hey, what did I miss? Time for a little snackage, huh? Yes! How'd you get that past her? Psst. Care to share? Is this trick brilliant or what? Hi there. Two movie tickets, please. Alrighty. Here you go. Let me put that in here. Ten dollars? Here you go. Thanks. Uh, can we also get two popcorns? Regular popcorn? Sure. I'll just add those two. Carry the two. And with tax, that makes it… Uh-huh. Then add the processing fee. And here's your grand total! How could that possibly be 300 bucks?! You thinking what I'm thinking? Whoa! Are you ready for this snack attack? Cuz we are! But as you likely already know, snacking calls for a more sneaky approach. Whether that means candy in your bra or pasta stuffed down your pants, the no snacking rule is meant to be broken. But be warned, it can get quite messy. But if you're hungry for some new, clever hacks to sneak food anywhere, stick with us. We got you covered. Let's get to eating, shall we? Another day, another class. And I could sure use an energy boost. Bring me down to sugar town. Just the smell is invigorating. Hey. Do I smell what I think I smell? Huh? Fine, here. Just a bite, okay? Hey! You're eating the whole thing! That was really good. Yeah, no kidding. My precious chocolate bar. I gotta hide this stuff better. Away from Bella's grubby fingers. But how? I sure have a lot of pencils. And thank goodness for that! Tape your pencils in a straight line. Place the candy bar on one end. Then roll it like a burrito. That way, it's totally hidden. Finally, the chocolate is all mine! Try
Try stealing a bite now, Bella. Hee <laughs> hee. I should've thought of this sooner. Is that chocolate I smell? I don't see any. What? Nothing to see here. My nose must be confused. Or I'm getting a migraine. All right, it's Monday morning. And time to get to work. Ugh, what is that taste in my mouth? Perhaps chowing down on the second helping of garlic chicken last night wasn't the best idea. Looks like a fresh mint is just what the doctor ordered. Whoa! If you share an office with a bunch of mint moochers like Mia here, you know the pain of having to share your stuff. If only there was a way to keep mm -hmm. your mints out of plain sight so no one could steal them from you anymore. Snag an old container like this one and put your mints or gum in there. Next, put the container underneath the plant right there in the pot. Great, that fits perfectly. Put that sucker right back onto your desk and no one will ever know your precious mint stash is hiding in there. In fact, those are so well hidden you may forget they're even hiding in there yourself. But in the meantime, you can enjoy fresh, garlic-free breath any time mm -hmm. of the day, moocher-free. Ah, that's so much better. Oh, there's Amy chomping away on M&Ms again. Man, I could really use some of those right now. Maybe if I ring this doorbell a couple of times, Amy will leave the candy alone so I can steal some. That's weird, I'm not expecting company. <sighs> I'd better get the door. And it worked! The candy is mine! Time to dig in. Hello? Anyone there? That's odd. Better eat as many as I can before she realizes there's no one at the door and comes back. Oh no! Amy's coming back! Oh, screw it. Just grab as many as you can and get out of there, Helly. Okay, where were we? Hey! Where is all my candy? Oh, come on! It's all gone? Not one piece left? Wait a minute. I have an idea. You look innocent enough, Mr. Teddy. I'm gonna turn you into the perfect hiding spot. Okay, if you're squeamish, you may not like what you're about to see. Just kidding. Kind of. Don't worry, you'll reattach it later. Go ahead and take some of the fluff out to make room for the jar you'll put in there. Get a small jar or container like this one, take the lid off, and place it into the torso of the bear. With a glue gun, outline the jar just under where the lid will screw on and press the surrounding fur on it. Pour anything you want in there. Candy, pretzels, you name it. Now put the bear head with the glued lid under it right back onto the top of the body. Screws right on, see? Aw, so cute! And when you get hungry for a snack, pop that sucker's head right off and take a handful of sugary goodness. Oh gosh, is that Helly I hear? Quick, hide the candy! Oh, hey! Nothing to see here. Hey, is that chocolate I smell? Nope, don't know what you're talking about. Just chewing some gum, that's all. I could've sworn I smelled chocolate. This teacher may be lively, but boy, is this class boring! Ugh. Almost dozed off there. Maybe a little sugar rush will wake me up. I'll just have some. Oh, is that my hair? Or is it growing its own? G get back in there! Now what do I do? That's it! My notebook! Did you know this can be a candy holder? Start by cutting the cover with a blade. And follow along the ruler just like this. Now get rid of the square you just cut. Now take a plastic pocket and tape it behind the open cover. Grab your candy and slide it into the pocket. The more colorful, the better! Start at the top and work your way down. Yeah! Just like that! It may look like candy now, but when you flip the book closed, it looks like a regular book cover! See? It's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen! Not to mention the tastiest! Mmm! 
And that, my friends, is the human body. She's done? Oh! Oh, stop! I'm blushing! Someone's one little thing can ruin the day. Stupid pencil! Ugh! Do I have another yellow around here? Jennifer has one. Whoa! These aren't pencils. But who cares when there's candy? You sure you want to do that, Kate? That's stealing. Finders keepers, losers sweepers. <laughs> Way to channel the dark side, Kate. Mmm. Being bad tastes good. To make your own secret candy stash, put some colored pencils together in a row. Then, with a glue gun, stick them together. Wait for it to dry. Then set it aside. Then get your favorite tin pencil case. Place your favorite sugary treats right inside. Try to fit in as many as you can. Yum! Once that's done, take your pencil decoy and place it on top. It fits perfectly! Put it back before anyone sees! Okay, back to work. Hmm, did anyone mess with my secret stash? I'd better check. Aha! Uh -huh. Kate! Care to explain my missing grub? That's it. No more treats for you. Ah, Don't be such a sourpuss.